Ay, 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 Gana. <laughs> Alaba. Hey, chao, chao. Muni abe mani. Yao gana. Na. Asem wei. And yes, say, eh, yeah, Kennedy, yao pong. Enchi. Ama yao gana. Mebe kan wansem. Na gana. E kam yae se. Omae ne yari. E yari. E chan se. Yen peni fwa. Ondi omae ne sunaye prong. Polikali desno. Omu pi. On trimu ye den. Na pesem in kumina. E ni a bronchi no. Oh, mama, oh, my, no. And go ye. But I can say, they are wicked and selfish. And they only think about their personal interest. Self-seeking individuals who have lined up into politics. This has got nothing to do with Kennedy Japan. I think it's got everything to do with the kind of dysfunctional system that has been in place for the last 29 years. And it's not fit for purpose. Then you make a You have a Japan appointment here idea man of to be board chairman of Ghana Gasi. And it happens over and over again. I didn't even know, say, MPs, this is the first time I'm hearing of it. MPs can be appointed to be board chairpersons of public institutions or what we called state owned enterprises. Why? Just say, Jimmy and Dawson, but excuse me, I'll say, Jimmy and Dawson, I will come and pay for it. Just a moody moon green or mine walk a crampo. Are these people the only people who can work for Ghana? I didn't pay for Momma Cola Casamanusa. Mina Cola, anyway, but you allow young people to also speak to you anyhow because you are few, you are refusing to screw your heads on your neck properly and think like grown ups. I'm one young son in India, moody poor mine, for the interest of all. Kennedy Japan, you have example. Kennedy Japan doesn't need to be the chairperson of Ghana Gas. What value is he bringing on board? Number one. Can't we have people who have got the knowledge and expertise in the gas industry to head or be the chairpersons of the board of such a state-owned enterprise? Can't we? The whole of Ghana? Do we have to look around just the political corridors of power to pick and favor certain individuals just because they are party people? Look, democracy now, you have to answer no. Honestly, I'm going here. Remember Kennedy Japan again. The reason why I'm using him as a typical example. Because on Okrampo there, he, he, he hasn't even got the time. Look, Kennedy Japan is a businessman. He shouldn't even be in politics. His hands are full. His hands are full. That is why he doesn't even contribute that much in Parliament. How many times have you heard Kennedy Japan talking in Parliament? How many times does he even go to Parliament? How many times? If he is a businessman trying to set up a couple of businesses and some of them are startup businesses, that takes a lot of your time already. He's one person. What time has he got to contribute very well in parliamentary discourse? Number one, or a businessman, or an MP, which is a full-time job as well. They are paid full salary. Full salary. He has constituents that he needs to get in touch with them and solve their needs. That's another thing. Number three, he is the chairperson of Parliamentary Committee of Interior and Defense. Another strategic committee in Parliament. Very, very important committee in Parliament. Why the chairman of that? So, this man has got four important jobs to do four important jobs to do chairperson of parliamentary committee a very important one interior and defense he's an mp he has got businesses he run and on top of that president Ekufuato. you know all these things and then you still make him you still make kennedy japan the chairperson of ganakas what ways can i use to describe you and your action this action with all due respect, Obi will train your mind away. Now he cares about the well-being and the progress and development of Ghana for all. He will look outside the box and appoint Ghanaians on merit, on merit, to be board members and chairpersons of state-owned enterprises. The president will have a special committee that 
that helps him to appoint deserving people on merit. No job for the boys. No favoring certain people. Say, yeah, I got a president and he said, Ubit, yeah, you can do any bullshit that you want. Excuse my friend. You can do whatever you like and get away with it. That is what it is now. Sana babe. Sana babe. Now, look, maybe I'm some bro. You're not politicians. I mean, I say, I'm being a bop. Move on, For lie to lie. When that day of reckoning comes in Ghana, most of you will regret going into politics. And it will happen at some point. If this foolishness doesn't stop, say, you say, who or Ghana? Politicians, you do whatever you like because you've got political power. No? Sure. I think the any impending day, you think castle. At some point, at some point, whatever you do, the law of karma works. It'll come back to hunt you. If you think, say, more ball mine up from, you're doing whatever you like because you can do it. And then that's the end of it. I know. That's not how it works. That is not how it works. That is not how it works. That is not how it works. Anyway, let me end here. God bless our homeland Ghana and make our nation greater and stronger. What's on for me? Until I come here again, don't forget to say a prayer, especially for Ghana, whatever it be. Now I'm you now. God bless us all.